I will not have it stolen. Hey guys, today I want to show you how you can one-shot bosses on a new game. All of the gear that's on this build can be obtained in one game cycle, meaning you don't have to go to NG Plus for this build. So for stats on the right, you see we've got 60 Vigor, we also have 54 Strength, which turns into 80 Strength when we two-hand our weapon, and 60 Arcane. We also have 20 Intelligence for Terra Magica, and 25 Faith for Golden Bell. For weapons, I'm using the Marius Executioner Sword, a Dragon Communion Seal to cast Golden Val, and a Cane Sword for Seppuku. I'm also using a Twin Bird Kite Shield for more damage when low on health, and an Albanoric Staff to cast Terra Magica. For headpieces, I use the Black Dumpling, which I switched to the White Mask, which I then switched to the Mushroom Crown. For armor, I'm using the Royal Remains set, which gives us health regen when below 18% health, so that's really useful for this build. For Talismans, I use the Lord of Blood's Exaltation, which I switched to the Kindred of Rot's Exaltation, which sometimes I'll switch to the Godfrey Icon for even more damage. And I also use the Millicent's Prosthesis, Wing Sword Insignia, which you can switch to the Rotten Wing Sword Insignia when you get to NG Plus for even more damage, and the Red Feather Branch Sword. And in my Physic, I'm using the Thorny Crack Tier and a Magic Shroud and Crack Tier. Now onto the buffs. I'm going to show you a video against the Godskin Duo since they were set up perfectly for all of the buffs. <laughs> 